I'm, um... I'm looking for Anna Scott. Does she know you're coming? No. No, uh, she, she doesn't. I'm afraid I can't let you through, sir. Right. I mean, I am actually a friend. I'm not a lunatic, but, uh... No, you, you basically, uh... Can't let you through, sir. Thought you were here yesterday. Well, I was going to call, but I. Uh, Anna. Yes. Um, things aren't going very well, and it's our last day. Absolutely. Yeah, you're, you're clearly very busy. But if if you could wait, there are things to say. Okay. Drink tea. There's lots of tea. Come and have a look. Are you a fan of Henry James? This is a Henry James book? Yeah. He'll give you a pair of headphones so you can hear the dialogue. Thank you very much. No problem. Hi. Hi. Here we go. Volume's on the side. Have a seat. Thank you. We are living in cloud cuckoo land. We'll never get this done today. Well, we've got you. I have to be in New York on Thursday. Oh, stop showing off. God, that's an enormous ass. I'm not listening. No, but seriously, it's not fair. So many tragic young teenagers with anorexia. And that girl has an ass she could perfectly well share around with at least ten other women. Still be big-bottomed. I would think, looking at something nice like that, you and your bony little excuse for an arse would be well advised to keep quiet. Now, down to business, the end of the scene. Um, I ask you when you're telling everyone and you say... Um... Tomorrow will be soon enough. And then I. Right. So who's that rather diffident chap I saw you talking to around the back? No one. Just some guy from the past. I... That's a bit of an awkward situation, really. I don't know what he's doing here. Thanks. Good over. Any time. 